नमस्कार माई सेल्फ सुविंद प्रताप सिंह फ्रॉम इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट आई वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू और डेली वीकली वेदर डिस्कशन प्रोग्राम टूडे दैट इज 19 मे 2022 लेट्स स्टार्ट द प्रेजेंटेशन हियर दिस इज द सिनोप्टिक फीचर्स डूइंग पास्ट वन वीक वन डब्ल्यू डी वॉज अफेक्टेड ओवर वेस्टर्न हिमालयन रीजन एंड एट जर्निंग नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया and went up from up to assam and southwesterly wind from bay bengal to towards northeast india causes extremely heavy fall during 5 6 days over meghalaya continuously one cyclone circulation lies over kerala which is likely to persist over the nearby regions and gives good rainfall amount over kerala tamil nadu and remnant of cyclone was there on 13 14 as a cyclone circulation over northern part of coastal coastal andhra pradesh and one trough from central india to southern peninsular india was prevailed over the week and this is the synoptic system of today one cyclone circulation over tamil nadu and neighborhood and trough from mp to this side sir one cyclone circulation over afghanistan and one trough over bihar and adjoining in metro west bay level and the advancement of the southwest wind to monsoon in view the strengthening of southwesterly in the lower tropospheric level wide spread rainfall activity and persistent cloudiness over the area southwest monsoon has advanced into the some parts of southwest south bay bengal most parts of andaman sea and andaman sea on 16th may it has further advanced into some more parts of south bay of bengal entire andaman sea andaman nico andaman sea and andaman nicobar islands on 18th may 2022 here this line you can see this is the blue color line shows that the covering of the monsoon over the region this is the weekly cumulative rainfall here you can see that entire southern peninsula east india and northeast india has received good rainfall amount the red color shows that more than 10 cm rainfall and including this western himalayan region and adjoining plains also received rainfall due to wd and here you can see isolated heavy to very heavy with extremely heavy fall during week was observed over meghalaya and one days over kerala with this heavy to very heavy rainfall initial 13 14 was over 13 14 15 over samal west bengal and is increase over arunachal pradesh and assam and over bihar on 16 south inter karnataka and 17 over bihar assam south interior karnataka and 18 over coastal and north interior karnataka kerala rayalseema and andaman nicobar islands here you can see the rainfall during past one week over the entire country as a country you can see the departure is positive 122% over east northeast india was 212 and over northwest and central india is negative while our south southern peninsula and northeast india is positive here they you can see in this left one figure that blue color is shows the departure in positive excess rainfall while yellow and red colors are deficiency or for the season here you can see the entire country shows deficit rainfall except over southern peninsula and northeast india heat wave over the northwest india mostly heat wave to see heat wave over west rajasthan was prevailed 13 14 15 16 16 as well as on 7 19 also due to wd 17 18 temperature was fallen so not no heat wave was observed on 17 and 18 overall over northwest india and adjoining central parts of india 
was received heat wave at isolated or some parts on 13 14 15 16 or as well as on 19 here you can see no cyclogenesis during two weeks likely to happen over bayo bayo bengal and arabian sea this is the forecast for rainfall that you can see over northeast and southern peninsula is likely to continue in week 1 over western himalayan region also likely to happen while in week 2 it is likely to reduce rainfall activity entire india except southern peninsula india and the today monsoon condition northern limit of southwest monsoon passes through 5 degree north 80 degree east to 16 degree north and 94.5 degree east and conditions are favorable for further advance of the southwest monsoon monsoon into some more parts of south and central bay of bengal and some parts of south arabian sea during next two days with this condition will continue to be favorable for further progress leading to the onset of southwest monsoon over kerala towards end of the week and this is the forecast due to strong cross equatorial flow over bay of bengal to arabian sea in low tropic level fairly wide spread to wide wide spread rainfall with isolated heavy fall and thunderstorm lightning gust wind likely over andaman nicobar island during the week with this a cyclone circulation lay over gulf of Mar Mar martwan and adjoining myanmar extending up to mid tropical level under its influence a low pressure area has formed over the same region <coughs> sorry on the evening of today the 19th may <coughs> sorry it is likely to be move more marked and move northeastward towards myanmar coast myanmar during next 24 hours due to this scaly wind weather with wind speed reaching 40 to 50 kmps gusting to 60 kmps likely to over north andaman sea and adjoining east central bay of bengal during first half of the week and for the northwest india due to the wd is likely to approach towards india due to this fairly wide spread to wide spread light to moderate rainfall with isolated thunderstorm lightning gusty wind and hail storm very likely over jammu kashmir himachal pradesh uttarakhand during first half of the week and isolated to scatter light rainfall with thunderstorm lightning gusty wind likely over punjab haryana north rajasthan uttar pradesh during 28 to 24th may will scatter to fairly wide spread light rain over the region on 23rd may with this dust storm thunderstorm very likely over uttar pradesh on 20th over rajasthan on 21st and 22nd and a strong surface wind with wind speed reaching 25 to 35 kmph over rajasthan on 28 and 21st and over punjab haryana uttar pradesh on 22nd and 23rd may 2022 and one cyclone circulation lies over north india tamil nadu it is likely to move northward during next two days and become less marked thereafter and trough especially north south trough from central madhya pradesh to tamil nadu causes fairly wide spread to wide spread rainfall with isolated thunderstorm lightning gusty wind very likely over kerala mai and karnataka during most of the week with this isolated extremely heavy fall is very likely over coastal karnataka today and isolated heavy rainfall on 22nd 28th may with this heavy to very heavy rainfall at isolated places over south inter karnataka today and isolated heavy rainfall also likely over kerala and mahe during next 48 hours thereafter it is likely to relax and is scattered to fairly wide spread light to moderate rainfall with isolated thunderstorm lightning very likely over tamil nadu rail sima and isolated rainfall thunderstorm over rest part of the peninsula india during the week with this isolated heavy fall also very likely over tamil nadu and rail sima during next 24 hours and due to the southwesterly wind from bay of bengal to northeast and adjoining east india in low, low tropospheric level wide spread rainfall with isolated heavy to very high fall very likely over arunachal pradesh on 29 to 21st over assam meghalaya and some himalayan west bengal sikkim during 29 to 22nd 
with this isolated extremely heavy fall very like lower assam meghalaya on 19th and 21st may rainfall activity will likely to decrease thereafter isolated to scatter light rainfall with isolated thunderstorm lightning gusty wind likely over bihar jharkhand gangetic west bengal odisha during most parts of the week with this light to isolated rainfall thunderstorm is likely very likely over central parts of country during second half of the week with this no significant weather likely over many parts of the country during the week and now the week to from 26th may to 1st june decrease in rainfall thunderstorm activity over northeast india as compared to week 1 and a strong westerly flow over arabian sea and trough over southern peninsula india light to moderate fairly wide spread to wide spread activity likely to over south southwest peninsula india and isolated to scattered rainfall west peninsula india isolated heavy rainfall is also likely over kerala coastal and south indian karnataka during many days of the week overall rainfall activity is likely to be normal to above normal over southern peninsula and central india near normal over east and northeast india and below normal over northwest and during the week and this is the temperature maximum temperature here you can see that week one over the central and northwest india and east india is likely to above normal while in week two is likely to reduce so maximum temperature no significant change in maximum temperature during the next two days over northwest central india and gujarat state fall by two to four thereafter so heat wave condition in many places with severe heat wave condition in isolated pockets over west rajasthan on 28th and heat wave condition in some parts on 29th may and heat wave condition in isolated pockets very likely over east rajasthan madhya pradesh uttar pradesh and south punjab and south haryana during next 48 hours and it is likely to abate due to the presence of wd <clears throat> or for week to maximum temperature likely to fall over most parts of northwest and adjoining east central india as compared to week 1 these are likely to be normal above normal by 1 to 3 degree centigrade over most parts of western himalayan region odisha and adjoining central andhra pradesh uh, sorry adjoining coastal andhra pradesh it is likely to be below normal to near normal over the rest of the india and no significant change heat significant heat wave is likely to over any parts of the country this is the relief for the our people for latest information and news you can visit our website mausam.imd.gov.in as well as for latest information you can visit many social media platform as facebook twitter instagram youtube blog where we can continue updating the bullet, the significant weather and warning as well as you can use mobile app as mausam app damuni app and meduta for latest information and warning thank you very much all of you to listening me namaskar